Hey guys, I'm back. My name is Michael or Avi and I know it looks like I've been crying. I've been having some fever dreams. Wow, it was a wonderful experience. Diarrhea, puking, migraines right around here. Sweating at four in the morning and shivering and like, oh, I don't know what's going on. And, and the thought of imminent danger and death. Maybe that's what inspired me to come back. <laughs> Sorta. I'm sorta back because not everything is back, but I thought long and hard about this decision. I was like, what is this channel going to become? I don't want to lose it. It has a lot of subscribers. It's so close to 100,000 and people don't want tinnitus videos. So you got that. No more tinnitus videos except the ones that I already recorded that still need to go back up. So every now and then they'll be around, but you know, that, whatever, I'm gonna make a tinnitus channel. There's no more tinnitus videos, except those that I just mentioned. Darknet, deep web, well, we need to discuss that. That is what I thought the channel's gonna be about, and it kind of was supposed to be about that. And then YouTube limited it, and people stopped watching me after that. I was like, I want to record about this, but I can't. And I promise you the Darknet market guides are not coming back up, and any reviews are not coming back up, and I'm not gonna be reviewing any Darknet markets. I'm I'm not going to be even interested in that, even though slightly I am. It's a controversial topic. I find it interesting and entertaining. We might discuss about markets if they're in the news. Something happened, for example, a darknet market fell down. Somebody's been arrested. But we're going to look at it from a different perspective. Drug content is kind of going away for now. Policies might change in the future where, for example, marijuana is becoming more legal in places, psychedelics are becoming legal in certain areas, or decriminalized in America in certain towns. But as is the case with many of these scenarios, YouTube does not follow suit until many years later. I do not feel it is safe just yet. Still, there are channels falling. Still, there are videos missing. And I do not want this channel getting banned a third time. This channel was banned twice before by accident YouTube got it back but the second time I appealed and got rejected and then Kubera my crypto channel fell down and then another channel was banned and the thing is with YouTube if you get one channel banned all of your channels get banned which is like why why would you do that YouTube so I don't want that happening because I want to create future channels I want my tinnitus content to stay up because that's important for society and for people with hearing loss and they need that support even my most controversial content some of it is entertaining but for the most part as unprofessional and as amateur as it was or is it was produced for one reason to educate others to help others and in a way it did help some maybe it wasn't the best content in the world but if i've received hundreds of messages asking for help or saying that i've helped them in some way one way or another whether it was getting them interested in creating a youtube channel or investing in cryptocurrencies or learning about programming even though i'm not a programmer some people got interested in that because of the deep web they thought wow this is a cool topic i've never really heard about it before or i've seen it on the webs but hmm. business is first that's youtube's approach okay it's not but they need to make money they've been bought out by Google years back and they're going to create profit eventually there's hours and hours of videos being uploaded to YouTube every single second and here's what has inspired me to change this channel and hopefully this is going to be a change for the good this channel is not going to be banned you guys are going to be happy I'm going to be happy YouTube's going to be happy everybody's going to be happy and we're going to see within the next few months how everything turns out I know this channel has been going up and down up and down and then it's kind of like whoa going off it's falling off the map so i have to treat this like a business i have to keep advertisers happy so youtube's happy so they don't demonetize so they don't limit so they don't age restrict so they don't do any of those bad things and they recommend my videos now they've taken a weird stance against kid creators and content creators that were focusing for kids and babies and all that stuff a few months back and in a way that's kind of helped adult creators and more controversial topics, but in another way, it's also gone against us. For example, months back, a completely weird thing happened where crypto channels were falling back down. They went back up after some people were like, what the hell? I wanna do everything I can to avoid that. And that's why I've been avoiding uploading on this channel and anything that was controversial. And in terms of the drug content, well, 
uh, I'll go back through my old videos and see what is probably good to stay up and what will remain private. Post every now and then something that probably isn't too controversial. Example, news-related drug content videos such as marijuana becoming legalized in a state. But that's the extent of that. Maybe I'll have some story times such as the old version of this channel. Of course, they're going to be censored and hopefully that is going to work for everything. So we're going to focus this channel on trying to be one topic and that's going to be something that I'm still sort of interested in even though it's caused me a lot of pain because every time I wanted to upload on this topic it's been banned. There is a solution sort of to that and to the drug content that's too controversial for YouTube. So you might have noticed a link in the description below and they'll take you to a website that's suited for influencers. You're able to ask them for advice and instead of having Skype conversations, you're getting on a phone call with them, you're able to get a private video. I'm going to add more categories and for the first five orders, we're going to have lowered prices, but already we had Chloe order over here. I was surprised because I didn't even advertise this yet. I just put the link in the description below. I went full out with her answer. I'm happy that she's happy and hopefully I'm able to answer some of your guys' questions. So if you're interested in this service, click the link in the description below. Thanks so much for watching New York City, baby. Oh, 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 oh. Living the dream, the American dream in Poland. Oh, yeah. So, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'm going to go take a shower now.